I began to create art, watercolors, and oils early on. And I remember how proud I was to buy my first easel. And I bought it from Sharon Williams, which was located downtown Fredericksburg. I'm Johnny Johnson. I'm a retired educator. I taught art in the public schools here. I love this area. I've been in this studio where my art was kept and created for over 40 years. And I'm very grateful to have been able to do that. As a part of his interest in people, he was also interested uh, in justice and equality of opportunity. And so uh, as a result of that, he became involved in many organizations within the community. I guess I've always been concerned about civil rights and, and working toward making things better for minorities. One community activity he was certainly involved in was the United Way. Because the United Way had a fundraiser. People in the community had an opportunity to get his paintings at an auction. And as a result of that, that fundraiser did extremely well. And he used his art ability to help uh, advance uh, the causes of those activities. I've enjoyed being able to work, donate a lot of my work for causes, and sell a lot of my work probably for causes too. Harambe, which was a theater group that my dad uh, founded, um, we wouldn't have survived without Johnny P. raffling off paintings every year at the Black Arts Festival. His artwork was in great demand at all times. It was never displayed for its own beauty or significance, and it, its impact was not simply because of its beauty and elegance, but it was because it helped to lift the lives of those in the community. Well, all the beauty is in his work, and his work will live on too. Um, uh, his, his work speaks for him, but to know him, that's his work. I've enjoyed uh, creating, and I have also enjoyed the response that people have given the work. I'm very, very proud to just say that uh, you couldn't find a better philanthropist than Johnny P. Johnson. His gifts go far beyond anything monetary. He gives from the heart. Probably every person in our church has a Johnny P. Johnson painting in the living room. I'm just so proud to be a part of his, what I consider his immediate family. Um, my son and, and his son are best buddies and there are Johnny P. paintings all over this house. Many he gave to my mom. Gladys P. Todd.